welcome to Tiny Treasures. We are at the Fisher Price Beach House today and it's a beautiful day. Who's inside the house today? Hello. Hey look, it's Daniel Tiger and he's wearing his explorer hat. Oh, does this mean we're going to explore today, Daniel? Is your sister coming with us? What about your mom and dad? Hmm, where are they? Oh, I bet baby Margaret is going down the slide. She loves the slide. Mom Tiger is watching baby Margaret go down the slide. And where's Dad Tiger? Maybe he's in the garage. Yes, he is. And he's cleaning up today. I guess me and Daniel Tiger will go explore. First thing we see is an unusual bug. Hmm, I'm not sure what kind it is. Do you know Tiny Fans? Let me know in the comments below. I see some grapevines. Oh, and there are bunches of grapes. Ooh, I love these grapes. They are so sweet. I'm going to try one right now. Mmm, so yummy. Did you know grapes are toxic for dogs? So we make sure that we watch puppy when we're eating grapes. This is what the inside of a grape looks like. It has crunchy seeds inside. Daniel Tiger spots one more type of fruit. There are apples that have fallen from the tree into the bush. Look at them all. We can't let them go to waste. They've fallen off that tree with the grapevine all over it. I'm going to collect all of these apples and use them to make applesauce. You know that fruit should be picked up off the ground so it doesn't attract animals like bears or raccoons. I put them in my big purple bag. And even if they have a few spots on them, I can cut the spots off and the apple's still good to eat. Good job, Daniel. You got lots of apples too. Thanks for exploring today. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today, Daniel Tiger and his family are visiting a garden with a beautiful tree house. We're also going to visit a real garden. This tree house has a beautiful rainbow coming out the side. Baby Margaret loves to smell flowers. Mmm, the pink and white flower is so fragrant. Hey, Look over there, I see a glass sculpture, says Daniel Tiger. Each sculpture is very unique and handmade with glass. Glass can be almost any color of the rainbow. What does this yellow sculpture look like to you? Daniel Tiger sees a little pond with a frog on a lily pad. There are even little glass sculptures on the mossy rocks and in the pond. Look closely and you might spot the whale tail. Do you see it? Hey, look over there, Dad. I see a fuzzy caterpillar. It's orange and black. They look exactly like the woolly bear caterpillars we have in our garden. Remember when all the caterpillars were on the Ninky Nonk train track and the Ninky Nonk couldn't get by? Eventually, these caterpillars will turn into a tiger moth and fly away. We love exploring gardens in the outdoors. It's time to sign the guest book. We've really enjoyed our visit. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. 
Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Daniel Tiger and his parents are in the forest riding their zebra print Fisher Price Jeep. They're on the lookout for some unusual mushrooms and slugs. Our kids love to go on this hike in the fall. And you may remember we found all of these beautiful mushrooms with our in the night garden toys. But Daniel Tiger and our kids know don't touch and certainly don't put anything in your mouth. Certain plants and mushrooms can be poisonous. So instead of touching, we take lots of beautiful pictures. Daniel Tiger has spotted some mushrooms over here. These are just teeny tiny ones. They're creamy brown in color. Ooh, and these ones are a dark black color. It looks like somebody or something stepped on these poor mushrooms. The underside of a mushroom is called the gills. Daniel Tiger is going to cross the little stream by stepping on the mossy rocks. Good thing he's wearing his hiking shoes so he doesn't slip. Daniel Tiger's mom has spotted some beautiful white mushrooms. They are a very unusual shape. It's time to take a picture. Oh, look, tiny fans. We've spotted our first big black slug. These slugs love moist environments and they can lay up to 150 eggs at one time. And as you may know, these slugs provide a slimy mucus. Nearby the slugs, they find some bright orange teeny tiny mushrooms. The kids call me over and they've spotted a big slug leaving a trail of mucus beside a small mushroom. And finally, we discover the big red mushroom that we found with Upsy Daisy and Iggle Piggle years ago. We even had a picture of them underneath the mushroom. What a fun family adventure. I hope you get out with your family into the trees and go for a walk. Be safe and have fun. And let me know what you find. Thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. We continue our journey in London. We are about to sit down for breakfast. And one very popular item at breakfast time was chocolate hazelnut spread. It tastes yummy, but it's very sweet and full of sugar. It's just a treat once in a while. Whenever Tiny Treasures Minnie has some chocolate spread, sometimes it gets on their face or their clothes. And we want to make sure we do not wipe our faces with our sleeves. That's not what our clothes are meant for. Instead, we use a napkin. Or at home, we use something called a roly-poly. We roll up these little reusable cloths. And whenever we're having some messy food, we use the soft cloths to wipe our faces and our hands. And then we throw them in the wash and we can reuse them over and over and not throw anything in the garbage. Here we are at breakfast in London. And of course, there's a little bit of a mess with our chocolate spread. I am having lots of fruit today. I'm not sure what this fruit is. If anyone knows, please tell me in the comments. I have some grapefruit, grapes, and I love pineapple. I want to talk about the chocolate spread more at the end of the video and impacts on our rainforests, so stay tuned. But for now, we're going to explore a little bit more of London and the gardens. What do you see in the tree trunks? Are they faces? They are faces. They have two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. 
although I think I saw one over here with just one eye. Oh, there's a couple faces that are missing an eye. I wonder what happened. In the middle of the garden, there was a huge stone sculpture. It looked like a beehive. Tiny Treasures Minnie and Tiny Treasures followed the brick path. They thought it would lead them to the hive. But then we soon realized they were just all separate circles that went around the beehive. In the back of the garden, I see some bamboo and a bush with bright red berries. It's important not to eat wild berries. They can be poisonous and can make you very, very sick. So we will just look at these berries and not touch them. And down below is a big piece of wood. Oh, and look who's on it. Peppa. Hello, Peppa. If we look closely, there are holes in the wood. That's probably from bugs. Wood like this can be home to many different creatures. Let's take Peppa with us to explore the rest of the garden. How about we follow the path? Oh, there's a little bench over here made of cement. And another piece of wood and some planter pots. Doesn't look like they are being used for anything. We find some stones with this beautiful greenery in between. So remember, tiny fans, I wanted to talk about the rainforests. Well, in this garden, we found a beautiful wooden sculpture. It's from the rainforest, but it wasn't chopped down. It was just a naturally occurring piece of wood. It wasn't alive. But did you know that people are chopping down our rainforests at a very quick rate? And one of the reasons they're cutting down the trees is for an ingredient called palm oil. It's used in cleaners, soaps, foods, and fuels. Palm oil can also be found in this hazelnut spread. The rainforests are home to many creatures, including orangutans, elephants, tigers, bugs, birds, and valuable plants. And once we cut them down, all of those creatures don't have a home. So what can you do to help save the rainforests? Well, palm oil is used in many foods, cleaning products, soaps, and fuels. Our hazelnut spread has sunflower oil. We make sure it doesn't contain palm oil. You can check the ingredients on your foods and you can make your own cleaning products too, like we do. We even made our own hazelnut spread in one of our videos with the chipmunks. We all need to do our part to take care of our earth. Please say no to palm oil. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. In our last video, we were on an adventure to Germany and we have all of our toys with us. We took a train to our hotel. The train was so busy that we had to stand up with our luggage for the entire hour train ride. But when we arrived at our hotel, in the lobby there were some special treats waiting for us. A jar of gummy candies. What did you choose, Chinese Treasures Minnie? I chose the gummy frog. That's right, they looked like little green frogs. Hey, you bit his head off. <laughs> Daniel Tiger, you chose a big blue dolphin gummy. That's too big for you, says Mom Tiger. Choose something smaller. So Daniel went with the red dog bone gummy. As we walk to our room, there are lights, colorful lights, in the hallway. And our room is big and bright. And what we noticed about Germany is that you get 
two separate covers in your bed instead of one big cover. Ooh, what's that? Candy. They've left us a Werther's original on our beds. We'll save that for later since we've already had a treat today. Hmm, magic lighting? This remote has different colored buttons so that we can change the color of the lighting. How fancy! Yellow, orange, blue. And now I change them to green. And then what color? Red and purple. That's right. All the colors of the rainbow. After our long trip to Germany, we are quite tired. Daniel Tiger is going to have a little nap in the bed. And Mom Tiger is going to have a nice, warm, relaxing bath. And we're feeling pretty tired too, so we're going to take our shoes off and lie in bed. Stay tuned for Adventures in Germany. Thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. I received a very special gift for Valentine's Day from my family. And I wanted to open it with our Daniel Tiger toys. It's hidden in our Tiny Treasures mystery box. Kitty is quite curious too. Whenever there's a box around, Kitty likes to hop in. And this is what my gift was. A big golden chocolate ball with a beautiful golden ribbon. Tiny Treasures is standing right beside me as I open this. Hi everyone. <laughs> I'll begin by taking the bottom wrapper off. It looks like a cupcake liner. For a very large cupcake. Daniel Tiger's whole family fits inside. Now let's unwrap the golden foil. I like to unwrap it very carefully so I can reuse the foil for a craft or maybe wrapping another gift. Underneath is a big round surprise golden ball and I can reuse this in other videos and put surprise toys or treats inside. It's important that we reuse and don't just throw things in the garbage. Oh my goodness! This is a giant chocolate ball. I don't even know how to open it. Tiny Treasures, could you please go grab me a spoon? Ah, they grabbed the Mickey Mouse spoon. It's a hollow chocolate ball. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Very delicious. And inside are two smaller chocolate balls wrapped in the gold foil. Let's unwrap one of these now. It looks like it's in a gold bar. Ferrero Rocher. It looks exactly like the bigger one. I'm going to have a bite and see what's inside. Oh, kitty, no eating chocolate. Chocolate makes animals sick. Mmm, it's like a, a soft, fudgy chocolate in the middle. 
And of course, I'm going to share this chocolate ball with my entire family. And thank you for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. Today we're taking a biology class with Daniel Tiger and his sister. It's called the Our Generation Life Science Set. We're going to learn about some organs inside your body. And the organs are actually removable like a little puzzle. Let's get started and open it up. We have a little white biology textbook called The Wonders of Life. And we also have a diagram. And this is called our anatomy torso. And the last object is called a molecule. And a molecule is made out of different kinds of atoms like oxygen, carbon, hydrogen. Let's have a look at the biology book. Oh, it's blank inside, so it's a notebook. Listen to the teacher and take your notes. Let's have a look at the torso. Come on over, Daniel and Margaret, so you can have a good look. Do you know what these are, the front tiny fans? They are the rib bones, and they protect organs like the lungs. And you'll see the little lungs, oops, slide it back up, are these little pink things. Oxygen enters our mouth and our nose and goes into the lungs where it enters our blood. There's the diagram of our lungs. Now we must take care of our lungs. Try not to breathe in toxins like smoke or car exhaust because it goes into our bodies. Now this is the heart and the heart has red blood and blue blood and blue blood doesn't have oxygen in it. Red blood does. The heart pumps blood throughout our whole body. Now this is the liver. It removes toxins from our body using vitamin K. And in order to get vitamin K, we need to eat greens like kale, spinach, and lettuce. If we remove the liver, there's another organ right here. And that is the stomach tiny fans. And there it is on the diagram. So you eat your food, it goes into your mouth, and then it travels down something called the esophagus into your stomach, where there are tiny little enzymes that digest your food. And then after, it goes into your intestine. There's a large and a small intestine. And your large intestine is actually almost five feet long as an adult. And the intestines absorb nutrients from your food. So now I need to fit all the organs back into the body. And there's the lungs. Hmm, how do they fit in here? Uh, there we go. And then the, oops, the rib cage keeps them all together. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye. Hello and welcome to Tiny Treasures. It's snowing out today. And every Sunday, Daniel Tiger and his family get outside for some fresh air. Today they're playing in the snow as a family. After they play outside, on Sundays they either rent a movie from the movie store or they go to the movie theater. Come get me, Margaret. The movie theater is a special treat for Daniel Tiger and his sister. Movie tickets are quite expensive but it's fun to do as a family. 
Hello and welcome to AMC. How many tickets, please? Two tickets for adults and two children, please. That will be $40 total. Mom Tiger hands her a $50 bill. Here are your movie tickets and $10 is your change. Enjoy the show. Next they go to the concession counter where they see chocolates, gummy candies, and on the menu is nachos, pop, hot dogs, popcorn, matzo sticks, and pizza. The popcorn has been freshly popped in the popcorn maker. Mom, can I please get a chocolate bar or some gummy candies? Pretty please? Daniel, you still have Halloween candy at home. Christmas is coming and you're going to be having lots of treats then. So I think we're just going to stick with popcorn today. Sugar isn't good for your teeth or your body. Daniel and his sister brought their metal water bottles from home. They take their water bottles with them everywhere. I'm so glad you guys remembered your water bottles. Those plastic water bottles are not good for the environment. Even though some are recycled, a lot still go in the landfills and they leak chemicals into our waters. Could I please have two medium popcorns easy on the butter, please? Coming right up. The popcorn is just finished popping. It's very fresh. That will be $10, please. $5 for each bag. Thank you and enjoy the show. Daniel and his family find seats in the front row. What will the movie be today? A feature with Kitty and Daniel Tiger car toys from Tiny Treasures. And thank you so much for coming to Tiny Treasures. Please subscribe to our videos. Goodbye.